Hello everyone. I'm really excited to be here today. I know you are too. Now we have done a lot so far, especially treating lessons that cover stories by famous writers. Now we are at the end of that unit and I'd like to take a review with you. Now this review will consist of what we have done throughout this unit. And I know that you have done a lot. So let's start. We've read stories by Michael Morpugo and by Dickens Smith. In Dickens Smith Hodge Hegg, these are some of the things we discovered. We discovered the characters Max, Petunia, and all the other sisters, and then mother and father Hodge Hegg or Hedgehog as it were. Now we know how Max was lost trying to find his way back home and also but he was hit by a bicycle when he tried to use the crossing that the human beings use all the time that was a pretty nice story and we learned how to understand the context of a story through that and how we can make our story interesting and funny one of the things we learned as part of our language skills was the adding of the suffix Lee, that is L-Y, so happily and quickly and speedily and all those kind of words having the suffix li added to them. That was one good lesson we had there. Then we came to learning about the little albatross. Reading that story was pretty interesting because it gave us a very good idea on how to write our own stories. We use the plan that Michael Mopugo used to write that story to make our own stories. Now these two stories help us to get a good idea of how to do our own stories and how different kind of writers write their way the, the way they write. Now I like to know which of these stories did you like best? Who was your favorite character in these stories? And why do you say that this was the favorite character? Now we also learned quite on the last few lessons on the suffix full and less. Can you use these suffixes in making your own sentences or adding them to words to make different meanings or improve the way you write or even speak. I hope this lesson and this unit has been useful. Now we'll be going on to a new unit but before we go on to a new unit I'd like you to write five things you have learned from the lessons we have done in lessons by famous writers. They can be anything, they can be anything from how to plan your story, how to write your story, how to read very well, how to use the suffix li, full or less, all these other things, things you have learned, tell me which one you have really learned and can use. And maybe if, you, if, it, if it's possible, use those to form sentences or show me an example of how you have used these things. I hope that this unit has been very beneficial to you. We shall be going on to the next unit to the very next unit in our lessons, which will be writing and learning about informative texts, informative writing. So before we get into that, let's once again go back to what we have done so far. If we have to watch the videos, let's do and then pick up what we have learned and share with one another. That will be the content of our Zoom lesson that we'll be having on Friday. Bye-bye and see you in a very good time.